It is Saturday. Saturday. And we are at the beach right now. Hey, it's a cruise line. Oh my gosh. Where is that leaving from? That's not South Boston, is it? You wanna go? No, but really, is that? That's a cruise line, right? Yeah, that's a cruise ship. It's a cruise ship over yonder. You can't see it though, because you're facing my beautiful face. Hey, yeah. how you doing, folks? <laughs> Welcome back. Let's go Thanks for joining here. us. We're just taking a little stroll. Um, we're gonna go over that bridge. You see that bridge back there? Yeah. yeah. We're gonna. Okay, we're, we're just gonna cut through the grass, even though I. I Yo, I don't think we were told that. The, the, I don't know. I don't like walking on grass. It's just a. Oh, yeah. That was definitely a cruise ship. Odd thing. But yeah, there is a cruise ship in the wild blue yonder. I don't know if you can see it. Maybe. Maybe. Kinda. My this arm already hurts. So, yeah, we're taking a stroll on the beach. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. We'll be back shortly. We're in Target, and I was like, wow, look at that cute little iPad. And then I was like, wait, what's the home screen? Ah, 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 ah. I'm just chilling on the net chair. I really like it. It's really bouncy. We are now at another beach. Hello. I mean, just check this drop right here. Ready? Ooh. Yeah. But yeah, the little uh, water lapping up on the rocks over there. So beautiful. Like a melody in my head, in my bed, on my truck, I light up the midnight moon. Baby, I see you. Waiting for Ryan because he had to go into the store and I'm going to pee my pants, but I'm waiting patiently. And that lady's staring at me. Because you look like a nut. <laughs> I'm just singing. I was singing some Luke Bryan for my, for my subbies. I got 39, 39 subscribers now. Ryan, what do you think of that? That's so cool. You guys are so sweet. I don't like to call you subscribers. I call you friends. I want to get the tripod and put it like right here. She thinks you're subscribers. I think you're as buddies. So maybe you should be my page. No. You're my internet friends. I was telling my mom, it's funny. I, we were in um, Bonds and Noble today and I, I was being nosy and some girl was looking at the book Cinder. And I was like, oh my god, I have to tell her about Splintered by um, A.G. Howard because I'm obsessed with that series. And uh, um, A.G. Howard is probably one of the sweetest authors that I've like been in like internet contact with. Like she will tweet back and she's just amazing. Very friendly person. Yeah, she's very friendly. So I'm in there and I'm like, you know, she's looking at Cinder. I'm gonna I'm gonna tell her she should look at Splintered. So I tell her to look at it, and then after we leave in, I was like, wow, mom, I feel like really good because I talked to like a human person today, and like I don't have anybody to talk to books about really other than like my internet friends on Twitter, <laughs> and I was like, oh my god, it was so great to just talk to a real human person. Humans. Human contact is actually a good thing. I don't know, I really don't have much to say. I just wanted to like sing and then the lady in the car next to me was looking at me like I was a freak. Don't say the word freak, please. Why? It's like the word freak. How come? I don't know, I, I feel like freak is just a very weird word. Like a, you're a freak. I feel like kids get called freaks all the time. I don't like it. Oh, okay. So we're not going to use the word freak. Alright, I was calling myself one though. Not, Creepy's good. Not in a mean way. You creep, that's good. Okay, so the lady was looking at me like I was creepy. What is everybody else's take on the word freak? I'd like to know. I've just never, I don't know. Mm -hmm. There's a lot of things that I'm very, like, mm, politically uncorrect about. Yeah, well. And I don't mean to be, yeah. but if I ever offend anyone, please feel free to comment below. Nicely. Nicely, yeah, nicely, because I don't, I, when I say stuff, I don't mean it. Your words will get across to us much more if you say it nicely than disrespectfully. Yeah. Anything we say on here is not to, to be mean. 
we oh. joke around a lot. It's never to put you guys, make yeah. you feel bad about yourselves. Um, so we're so comfortable with ourselves, we can say it. And we're, when we're mean to each other, we're not really mean to each other at all. More, there's road work everywhere. So I'm gonna like, you know, try not to pee my pants while I get home. See you guys. <laughs> see you, so you can see you. So we went on a date night to our favorite date night spot. And it was good, I got ziti and meat sauce. Ryan got mm. chicken palm salt, his huge. I have the cutest little romper on that I just got today. Like, oh my god, O-O-T-N, outfit of the night, babe. I know what it is. That's what it means, outfit, outfit of the night. Gosh. I need a selfie stick because this would be so much easier to hold. But yeah, that's just a little update tomorrow is my nephew's birthday parties. One is turning seven and one is turning 11. And we're gonna go to some like jumpy place, bouncy house place. So that should be a good time. 10 o'clock in the morning on a Saturday morning. Way to kill a Friday night, guys. Just kidding. We're like we're like an old married couple. We prefer to stay home. And I'm reading. Wow. Why am I talking so much? Like breathe, Christy. Breathe. I'm reading a Storm of Swords, which is the third book in the Song of Ice and Fire series, aka Game of Thrones series. This guy's making a legal turn. Can you pull my romper down in the back? No, like down here, honey. Thank you. It's like riding up a little bit. <laughs> do all rompers do that? Are they supposed to do that? I don't know. But there's our evening. Go home. Snuggle up. Not with each other. <laughs> we don't do that. With the dogs. <laughs> and I'm gonna read Ryan, probably go to sleep. He doesn't feel very well. Signing off. So at my nephew's birthday parties, and I'm clearly sweating because there's like all bouncy houses everywhere, and we're jumping all over the place like we're 12. <sighs> to be young again. story is Ryan's moving on up and getting a beautiful Jeep Patriot which we haven't figured out a name for her yet if anybody has any J names J or P names oh or P because yeah yeah J or P we're trying to spend the day just getting all the stuff done all stuff I found my sunglasses my old sunglasses that have been on vacation to like all over the place and I thought they were missing after vacation, uh, after my last vacation on the cruise. And my mom found them. She's awesome. All right, I will give you an update shortly. Say see ya. See ya. See ya. Okay, so we're vlogging in um, this beautiful <laughs> 2015 Jeep Patriot. And, um,. We, it, had, it has a cute little like grippy area, and we thought maybe the camera would fit, but it doesn't fit. Don't but that's fit. okay. It fit good when it wasn't like zoomed, but when you hit go, it like 
okay, that's not going to work at all. Well, you need a tripod. I need my tripod, and it's all the way upstairs, and I don't want to go get it now. It's really hot. Like, see, like, I just want it to be like that. But it's not going to stay. No, no, that's right. Sorry, once I start moving. But, like, see, it was so close here. Yeah. It was so close. It kind of works, right? Well, this is the angle that's going to have to work. We'll see if um, it works. Oh, this car's beautiful. Like, so beautiful. It is on small. It's funny because he had like this little baby car. She wasn't a baby car, but. It's not called Fiona, baby, okay? <laughs> it jiggles. It's like my belly. <laughs> latitude? Mm -hmm. Like an attitude? My crush has got attitude, but I got a latitude, and I didn't go good. Because that Ford being a Duba. Yeah, four Duba. Oh, he's flying. Yeah. All of a sudden, too. He's like, haha, I told you you should not cut me off. Okay, well, this is. Well, I will bring the tripod next time. Ooh. They're right. painting. Wow. Oh, I thought they were painting the trees. <laughs> They're painting the trees. I was like, why are they painting the trees? They weren't. They were painting the fence. And uh, we're going to go do some stuff today. Stuff. And, um, yeah, I don't know. I'm going to go to the Puffa place. And Starbies. Though I did get new Birkenstocks. Well, by new Birkenstocks, I mean, like, the only pair I ever owned. <laughs> but they were never worn. Just like this car was never driven. Right. Except to get gas. Oh, hi, birds. Yeah. Once my nails are done and stuff, I'll show you them. Maybe on vacation, because I'll do that before vacation. T minus one week and a couple days. Yes. All right, see ya. See, see ya. See ya!